Supply at me is a big opportunity for investors. Supply at me capsule share had soared and the price is up and it looks like a bright future for the company. One of the reasons for the big rise in share price is the announcement of signing a formal business alliance with a company called Epic Sim for inventory funding. If you have not heard of Epic, it is an Italian investment company and fintech platform that produces working capital solutions. They allow small and medium-sized companies to present their projects to qualified potential investors. This alliance will establish a brand new sales opportunity and channel for Supply at Me Capital. They will increase the scalability and improve the efficiency of their current process. Their target is to originate at least 75 client companies by the end of the year and up to 250 throughout next year. For those of us looking to invest in exciting new companies, this is a major step for those who are watching from a distance and sitting on the sidelines. This development may be the one that makes even more investors take a risk on these stocks. Impressive alliance and partnerships through a time of uncertainty will help this shares throughout the rest of the year. About Supply at Me Capital. Supply at Me Capital PLCS LAN. SIME is a very innovative tech platform that offers inventory monetization. This basically means the company has found a very forward-thinking way of improving different manufacturing and trading businesses to increase their potential capital position. This means they enable businesses to increase their working capital position, generate cash flow, by releasing capital from their inventory. They do this by proving a so-called true sale of inventory to purpose vehicles associated by Supply at Me this then provides new assess to potential investors. They can manage to do this by creating a model that can bring together the companies and funders from a wide array of markets and sectors through a very secure program. Supply at Me is working as a service provider rather than actually acting like a lender through its balance sheet. Very cleverly the platform has been created to align businesses who are looking to monetize parts of their inventory for cash with potential investor funders, for example banks, and large financial institutions who have that capital. This then allows these institutions to choose to invest through this platform into portfolios via securitization special purpose vehicles. This is very similar to the more commonly known peer-to-peer -peer lending. This has created an optimal situation for all parties involved and a true win-win scenario for both sides. This model is more of a long-term gain for businesses so it is not an option for quick cash solutions or gains but will create very good working capital for fixed long-term income. The London-based inventory finance fintech is planning to buy £200 million worth of stock from other British companies during the month of September. This is fantastic news suggests that the main target is to get around 10 manufacturers in their pilot scheme by the end of the year. Headquarters now in London Supply at Me, who moved their headquarters to London from Italy back in March have suggested that they have 1.4 billion demand for their inventory monetization lined up for the next month. They have raised over $400 million through investors worldwide. This will give them the opportunity to buy the stock from 40 companies even though there are 47 companies in total who are known to be waiting to be a part of this monetization. How does Supply at Me actually work? Put in layman's terms this company helps free working capital for manufacturers who want to buy raw materials and then have these materials sitting in warehouses waiting to turn them into finished goods and products. When the manufacturer is approved as a seller they can sell the inventory to Supply at Me which uses complex blockchain technology to record the transaction. This then means that the Supply at Me then owns all of the inventory that has been purchased, even though it never leaves the possession of the manufacturer's property and warehouses. By doing this the manufacturers can choose to buy back the stock at slow increments at the same cost plus VAT. Supply at Me then charges around 6 to 8%. They can also decide to use the released capital instead. Meaning they can buy more stock and keep the process going. Do banks do the same? Yes banks do lend against inventory a lot of the time, however it is normally fro around 20-40% to 40 of the stock cost. And you must also factor in the fact that this will affect your company's credit rating. This is one of the many ways that makes Supply at Me an innovative and unique option not really seen in the marketplace before growth potential. The company has said due to COVID-19 many more companies are looking to build their inventory which can help them steer away from supply chain shortages and because of this the loss of potential trade. 
When companies look to increase the monetization for higher volumes of stock being held it is good news for the subsequent growth of supply at me and it looks like it will continue to grow the rest of the quarter. The full-year report suggests higher levels of demand for its services as all supply chains try to adapt and evolve through the post-COVID-19 economical climate. Continued progress. The company has increased its client base from 66 to 97 since June 30 this year. With this growth and the pilot commencing with a large financial UK institution there are no signs of the growth slowing down anytime this year. CEO buying more stock. The CEO Alessandro Zamboni has also recently bow more shares in Supply at Me Capital. This is always a good sign when the CEO is investing more in the company he runs apparently purchasing 1.63 BN SIME shares through his other company Orchestra Group. This happened back on August 17, 2020 for 0.6756p per share. All good signs to jump in and get involved. I think so. The potential risks. Let's take a look at the potential risks to investing in this stock before we decide to jump in a buy a load of shares. We must calm down and realize that yes, this is still a young company and it is still in the early stage of growth so we have to be realistic when thinking about investing in newer companies especially because of the economical climate. You may want to put it on the side burner and on your watch list. Sit back and analyze for a little bit longer for those of you are more weary of taking risks and are more conservative. Conclusion. As a long-time investor I personally think it is an interesting time for Supply at Me Capital. I am very impressed with the new developments and I think the only way these shares are going and this company is going in the next few years is up. They have all of the signs of a profitable company with a lot of room for continued growth. Some may be reluctant to invest as the price share is up over 1000% in a month with the market cap being 220 mil this is still a early start with no profits yet. Only time will tell though.